I want to show you how to set up gestures in SwiftUI. It's really simple. In fact, you can add gesture to any component that you want. But right now, we add it to the main card, and this is what we see. I'm going to drag, and that's it. And I'm limiting to the Y position. I could have done both ways with the X position as well. And the way that I'm doing it is first by setting the state, which is equal to zero by default. And then I'm adding a gesture to the card using the drag gesture because we have a bunch of them. We have the tap, we have the long press and so on. And then for the drag gesture, we have two events. The first one is on change, which means when we're dragging and on end when we're releasing. And on each of them, I'm changing the state with the value that I'm getting from these events. And I'm specifically choosing to receive the translation to update my state. And then finally, using the update in the state, I apply that to the offset property, specifically to the Y position. Let's try to animate the card bag while we're dragging. So I'm going to go to the card bag and I'm going to add offset. I'm going to change the Y position asking is the view state height, which means the Y position greater than 100 question mark. And if so, I'm going to move the Y position to minus 100 and else I'm going to not change it. Watch what happens. I'm going to move a little bit, nothing, but a little bit more. And there you go. Sometimes you're going to see this UI where you have a modal and then you can swipe and dismiss the modal. So let's try to do that. I'm going to go to unended, which means when we release, I'm going to ask if self.viewState.height is greater than 200 curly braces. I'm going to set the view state is equal to CG size because that's the type that we have for the view state and set it to width and height. So width is X position. I'm going to set it to zero and 800 for the Y position, which is expressed in height. Let's set the else statement. So I'm going to put this self view state to zero, which means resetting. So this is what's going to happen. So I'm moving a little bit. I can release from here. It's fine. But after 200, it just dismiss. Finally, we're going to allow people to jump back into the modal. So we're going to go to the card back. And when we press on the card back, then it's just going to reset everything back to normal. So I'm going to go to the card back and add dot tap action curly braces and set it to self dot view state is equal to dot zero, which means reset. So let's see what happens. I'm going to drag and then after 200 dismiss, but I tap back and it resets everything. That's what I have for you today. I hope you enjoy it. I have a course that I'm really nervous about that's coming next week on the 26th. And if you want to support my content, please go ahead and pre-order it. Thank you so much.